What's going on everybody? It's Hot Pod King Carter here, the Superman of YouTube. And I want to talk to you guys about a little My Team news for NBA 2K14. Now this may not be as much news as everyone has been anticipating, but it seems like My Team Mode will be returning with new player modes such as multi and single player tournaments, and you can play with your friends this year. Now when I went out to NBA 2K14 team up, they weren't really trying to talk about modes with us. All they wanted to focus on was gameplay, gameplay fixes, uh, cheese fixes, you know, new player motion, new dribble layouts, new stick layouts, new everything that had to do with gameplay. But uh, so when it comes to the modes, there was really nothing that they gave us. So when we got back and everybody wanted to know about my team and my career association mode, and when they found out about Cruz, everybody was like, what's going on with Cruz? So the only news that we currently know is that it's just going to be new player modes. It's just going to be new single player tournaments and that you can play with friends. Now, in my eyes, I kind of want my team to be a little different. And this is why um, in the current my team, which is NBA 2K13, you could choose signature skills, attribute bumps for one game, and you could choose jerseys, court, playbook and coach. Now, that's cool. But how about giving people the choice to customize their actual player that they've paid for? Such as, if you buy LeBron James, can you equip him without the headband? With Instead of wearing the LeBron 10s, how about you have him wear the LeBron 9s? Or, you know, whatever LeBrons may match the uniforms that you choose for your team during that game. So, you know, people like me, I'll probably have like KD with like a headband, a sleeve on his arm or something like that, a couple wristbands. I just want that full custom customization factor of my team since everybody thinks that this mode is so great. Now, when talking about sneakers, maybe instead of just having whatever brand that player is signed and contracted under, how about you give guys the choice to wear all Jordans? You know for their team because I've, I've done many of these things in association mode whereas though I'll put on the retro jersey for my uh, guys whoever didn't have a shoe contract I'll give them all teammate uh, great sneakers which are you know different Jordans that I would pick and you can do this for any other shoe so why couldn't they add this to my team so it's where um, LeBron might have his LeBron nines KD might have the fours you know stuff like that CP3 might have the threes like you know just get just give a little bit more you know of that customized feel to the gamer now I know a lot of people seen uh, LeBron James had the I promise uh, power band on you know how about you guys let people put those on different players or if you guys are gonna have different um, logos words or something like that on those bands how about you just give the gamer the same custom customized feel as they would in any other mode because if you go to the home screen and you change up all these different things like his attributes his uh his signature skills and all this that's a fully customized thing that you can do on the home screen so just send it into another mode now uh the last thing i want to say before i get up out of here my team in the vc something has to be done about this because everybody knows that you know, you could either buy VC or you could glitch VC for NBA 2K13. For NBA 2K14, what I would like to see is my team have not a totally different currency, but have VC in its own within that mode, which means you can use outside VC for that. You can glitch it, you know, and whatever is sent to your server, make sure that the VC was only accumulated in my team. Now, the purchasing factor, say somebody wants to purchase VC in my team mode, you guys should make a new list for your prices, which means if the person wants to just buy VC when the game first comes out and upgrade their my player to a 99 just for the blacktop or for crews, then VC should be set at a higher price. Same thing in my team. If people are just going to buy all this VC, get Chris Paul, uh, Kobe Bryant, 
LeBron James, KD at the four, Dwight Howard, stuff like that. If people are just going to buy VC and just get a bomb squad and make it to the first seed or play against their friends and cheese and all of this nonsense with all these great players, you guys should up the ante. Now, when it comes to VC, I've seen that you could buy, I think, 10,000 VC for like uh, $3. You guys should up that a little bit. Now, I know a lot of people are probably thinking, iPod, why would you tell them to up the VC? That's just letting them make more money. Well, in the same sense, it's actually making guys that play the game hardcore, like myself, actually be able to play the game and not have to worry about people just paying for whatever they want. Because when I come out on a blacktop first game, I don't want to be a 99 with jewelry on. You know what I'm saying? I'd rather play... 50 blacktop games 20 my career games and then you know rise be like an 80 or something like that i want to earn my vc i don't want to buy all this vc and be the best player on the court i don't want to buy all this vc and have the best my team on the court i don't want to buy all this vc and have the best crew on the court i want to earn everything that i get so you know this is just this is just a punch in the face, man. Just just wake up. This 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 one of those little slaps when you sleep and somebody slap you and tell you to wake up, pour water all over your face, you guys gotta wake up. If you guys are gonna be making money off of VC, you gotta up the ante so guys like us that play the game, that actually want to have fun with the game instead of abuse the game, can actually have some some sense. So um this is IKC signing out. I'm probably going to come out with a, a video for Cruz a little bit later. But, you know, this this was solely about my team and the VC problem and being able to customize more than just your court, your coach, your playbook, and your jerseys. I want to be able to customize the players as well. I want to be able to strip LeBron of everything he has. He just out there. No headband, no power band, none of that. Shoot, if I could take the tattoos off of my wood. But, uh, you know, but this is IKC signing out. Just having a little bit of fun. I'm going to holler at you guys later. Peace. This is Siri. Thank you for watching and be sure to like this video. For more videos from this particular mode, click more videos. If you want to see more content from IKC, click subscribe. Oh, and don't forget to follow IKC on Twitter and to like his Facebook page. This is Siri signing out. Peace.